Welcome, this is Jan Carosa, and I'm the author of How to Bootstrap E-Commerce with Performance-Based Marketing. I wanted to share with you another one of my templates that I use with my clients. This one is the editorial calendar. And nothing is more frustrating than have some big holiday or event slip by you or come up too fast where you didn't have as much time as you would like to plan. So typically with each new year, I'm planning for all the events that I can anticipate at the time. Granted, these things change day to day as new things come up, but it's nice to start with a plan for the year, knowing what big events are going to take place that impact your business that you need to respond to and plan for with content and assets and materials to help provide new products for your uh, fans. So some of the areas I'm gonna share with you are taking a look at the whole year ahead of you in terms of the events that are upcoming, in terms of the content that you can build to support those events, and in the case of having assignments either with team members or with other joint venture partners that you might have when you're doing an article together, you'll each have different timelines and deadlines for the assignments that you have. So here's a look at the events calendar that I create. So I look at the year in total, what things are going to be helpful in terms of the industry of my client, whether it's health and wellness, are they going to be able to look at New Year's resolutions and what impact that would have on the sales of their products and how can they support that? And are they going to have new products? When do they plan on having those introductions so that you can back time all the efforts to support that? Do you have any trade shows, whether they're virtual because of COVID or whether they're regular as we get back to normal business trade show events where you need to back time all the assets, everything from what you have at your exhibit to the materials that go in it to the materials you give away any updates to your website as you go into these programs for the different uh, big events that you have during the year. Um, in this case, you can see I've outlined maybe we plan to do something where we uh, deliver a white paper every three months or so. And then what kind of announcements do we anticipate within the company and what holidays might affect our company. So with that, I'm taking a look at what would be supported under there that we know about. Maybe we're planning to co-author something. What's the deadline for that? And can we back time that? Or is there industry legislation, for instance, that affects our industry when that comes about and we anticipate it? What are we going to do to back time our content so that we can have everything ready to go and up and running when we need it? The next spreadsheet on that is the calendar itself where you kind of block out, do we have a monthly newsletter? What would be the deadlines for that? And then socking in the different white papers that we plan, the trade shows that we plan, our emailings, uh, trade show uh, press releases that we might need to do, when do those need to go? And then do we have articles planned as we start to work with trade industry newspapers or different other media to help support what we have going on, whether it's podcasting events that you have and you want to keep getting another uh, guest host spot. And then your social media would be an ongoing element as part of your content. The content assignment calendars, when you work with a joint venture partner or another team member, and you can kind of determine what are we shooting for? Well, we wanna do a publication article together. Here's when the publication will come out. Here's when we need to deliver it by. Who are the authors working on it? What are the goals and description? Even down to the keywords, the hashtags and the Im image, who's getting those together for the assets for our assignment calendar. So if you want to get this template, any of my other templates, you can go to dmcenter.com and just do a search on seven templates and you can find it there. 
You can also get a free look at the 2021 holiday hashtag calendar I've created at my site. Just search on 2021 holiday hashtag calendar at dmcenter.com.